story is about bald eagles. Is the population increasing, and where can you see them in the UP? TV6's Anna Samovska spoke with bird experts to find out those answers, and she joins us now. Anna? Steve, it turns out it's not that hard to spot this breed of eagles. Experts say that's because the population has grown significantly over the years, and because of that, these raptors were taken off the state's endangered list in 2009. Their beautiful colors can be seen all over the nation, but this national emblem seems to have populated most of our land here in the UP, and experts say they're not going anywhere anytime soon. But that wasn't always the case. These bald eagles were removed from the state's endangered species list just two years ago. A pesticide known as DDT was a longtime killer of these raptors. It was due to the DDT back in the 70s that made the eggshells soft and they would break when they would get into the nests. Once DDT was banned, their population grew. The DNR now recognizes more than 600 breeding pairs in Michigan alone. The UP Raptor Rehab Center in Gladstone has already taken care of 20 injured bald eagles, most of them hit by trucks. They can't fly up into the woods. Right. So they got to go out into the open, which is right out under the road. Many of our Facebook viewers have spotted bald eagles everywhere in the UP, from Iron Mountain to Goose Lake to Eagle River. But you won't see the bald eagle migrate anytime soon. Experts say they tend to stay by water until it freezes over. If there is water in the area during the winter, it's very common to see bald eagles stick around throughout the winter. As long as they have a spot where they can find fish and eat and have water, they will be here. But don't expect to see them eat just anything. They can be pretty picky. They won't eat hot dogs or stuff like that that's got any flavoring or anything in it. But I use hamburger, chicken, turkeys. So anybody that cleans their freezer out. And they Steve, the DNR office also asks anyone who spots an eagle's nest or a breeding pair to contact the office because they do have a database where they keep track of their population trends. Back to you. Thanks a lot. Very beautiful birds.